I guess, when I can't fix the problem. But I can open this door for you, so let me do that. Was I a failure for not understanding this game? I mean, I don't know why I would be. It's not like everything needs to have a solution, but I feel it somehow. I feel like I failed, and I don't understand why. I remember, it's June of 2011, I'm playing this for the very first time, and as I'm playing, I'm thinking to myself, I don't know this person. I have no idea who this person is. It wasn't the guy I knew, it wasn't my friend. I had come to so many conclusions from looking at all of his work up to this point, and then suddenly none of them... I had been trying to, though, that was the thing. For years, I was trying to get to know him, to understand who he actually was and, and what he stood for. I asked him so many times to please just tell me what his games mean to him. I asked him please to tell me what the three dots mean. And he wouldn't. I, I just felt so strongly that if I could have connected with him, that if I could have somehow made his work my own, that I would finally be once and for all happy. It was that I needed to see myself in someone else. I needed to be someone other than me. But he stopped and left. And it felt somehow like I had failed. Where did I screw up? I'm the reason that you stopped making games, aren't I? It's because of what I did. I poisoned it for you. I don't think I ever told you this, but when I took your work and I was showing it to people, it actually felt... <laughs> it felt as though I were responsible for something important and valuable. And... The people who played them, they treated me like I was important. They really listened and cared about what I had to say. Even though I was showing your work, it was... I felt good about myself. Finally. For a moment, while I had that, I liked myself. And then you stopped. And I didn't have anything left to show people. I, I just had to... Be with myself. And as soon as that happened, there was no feeling at all. Nothing. Less than nothing. What does that mean? I'm afraid that I did something really stupid because I don't like myself. That's why I'm releasing this collection of your work, is because I haven't been able to find any other way to reach you. I've tried everything. And so a part of me has hope that if I put this compilation out into the world, and if I put my name on it, that maybe enough people will play it so that it'll find its way to you, so that I can tell you that I'm sorry. I know I screwed up. If I apologize to you truly and deeply, Will you start making games again? Please, I need to feel okay with myself again. And I always felt okay as long as I had your work to see myself in. I mean, is, is something wrong with me? Because I know that I did an awful thing, and I'm doing it again right now. Like, I'm, I'm showing people your work, but I can't stop myself from doing it. That's how badly I need to feel something again. Like, I'm an addict. There has to be something wrong with me. Can I apologize? What if I tell you I was wrong? Will that work? Will that fix it? I, I, I don't know. I don't think it will, but there's nothing else that I can do. Just tell me what you want. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, 
start making games again. Please help me. Please give me some of whatever it is that, that makes you complete. I want whatever that wholeness is that you just summoned out of nothing and you put into your work. You were complete in some way that I never was. And I want to know how to, how to, I want to know how to be a good person. I want to know how not to hate myself. Please. I'm fading. And all I want is to know that I'm going to be okay. more people telling me that I'm good. Always more, more, more. It's like a disease. Solution, solution, solution. I guess if someone had told me ahead of time that he just really enjoyed making prison games, maybe I wouldn't have thought he was so desperate. I wouldn't have told so many people that he was depressed. Maybe he just likes making prisons. Even now, the disease is telling me to stop. Don't show people what a shitty person you are. They'll hate you. that my life depended on finding something to be driven by other than validation. What would that even be? <laughs> it's strange, but the thought of not being driven by external validation is unthinkable. Like, I actually cannot conceive of what that would be like. What now? I think I need to go. And I'm sorry, because I know that I said that I would be here and I, and I would walk you through this, but I'm starting to feel like I have a lot of work to do. I have a lot that I need to make up for. And so I'm just gonna Okay.